Welcome to Ricky's Reviews. Now this week is a special week because right here on Channel 10 are the Oscars live. So I'd like to take this moment to give you my picks of who I think will win an Academy Award. So let's go through it. I haven't seen this list yet. Let's start with motion picture. Um, ooh, a lot of movies here that I... Avatar, I fell asleep through that. Blindside, yeesh. District 9 was pretty good. You know what? I don't think this is right, guys. Is this the right list? Because I could have swore Twilight New Moon would have made this list. Tim Burton is at it again, taking a classic children's story and putting the Tim Burton twist on it. Alice is now all grown up and finds herself being forced into a marriage proposal with a nitwit. Alice soon runs away and down the rabbit hole she goes, back to Wonderland, where she is reunited with some old friends and learns her true destiny, dethroning the Red Queen. Chances are if you disliked Charlie and the Chocolate Factory, you'll be disappointed here as well. Pretty colors, 3D effects, and talking animals could not save this film from poor storytelling. Now Tim Burton does do a tremendous job visually, and 3D makes it even better. Well, it seems like Oscar snubbed Twilight New Moon. So, because I don't even see Robert Pattinson in for best actor, so in a leading role. So I'm just gonna go random on this. So we're just gonna go uh, Avatar for best picture. Performance by an actor, Jeff Bridges in Crazy Heart, supporting actor, uh, pass. Performance by an actress in a leading role, Sandra Bullock in The Blind Side, and let's go supporting actress, okay, Monique and Precious. Remember folks, this Sunday, live right here on Channel 10, you can watch the Oscars. I'll see you next week.